very simple, familiar chat interface. If you click Kezala, you go there and you'll see like these are just different groups that you're normally used to. If you go to a group and show how it looks inside the chat, the chat group, uh, you see just like any other chat. The one difference you'll see for making it purposeful, for example, the video, the, the group, the pictures over here, we have not sent one picture at a time, but we have created a photo story where you can actually skip through and you can look at the photos. But you can also do likes and comments on the video. Can you do like here? Please. Yeah, like or you can put comments. So when seeing in, in a consumer chat app, you talk about a picture, you talk in the chat itself. And it becomes very cluttery. You don't know which picture you're talking about. Here you can put comments on the on the on the picture actually. That's very small uh, little way to make things more purposeful or less noisy. Uh, going out and showing the hierarchical group, can you go back and show how a group and this other groups actually? If you go to the Contoso, here you can see Contoso sales group, but then there is not sales, not zoom sales contoso. So if you open that. Go to the arrow, you can see who are in the in the north zone. That's how it is south zone, east zone, west zone, and then the group is all connected. So when you send the information or content, any message on the sales group control zone, everybody gets it. But the owner of the north zone could actually send message to the north zone only. And they can talk among themselves. So that's the group of groups or hierarchical. Now going, so what is so that was the group stuff. And these groups could be millions of people now. There's no limit. I'm looking for a challenging customer that wants to uh, hit our limit. Uh, so that will help us. The second one I would say is, if you go back, just like in any chat, you can do chit chat, that's good. But in our, if you go to a group and show the photo sharing experience. Yeah. So if you go to any group, just like any other chat app, if you go to the bottom left, you can actually share pictures and pictures and uh, pictures and contacts. Just show the drop down, please. You just the drop down, attach. Yeah, this is drop down. Now, but what we have done is we have extended that that metaphor of sharing pictures and contacts and documents to send mini apps or cards. Go back to the top of the card and do a uh, show all the cards. So here are the out of the box cards. You can send an announcement. You can send a quick poll, a job, you can assign a job to the set of people who has to uh, say completed or not completed, that you can do track later. Uh, let's meet, survey, photo with location. The training card is the bottom left, training card. But if you, if you want more cards, you can discover cards, go to the discover button. You can actually go discover other cards that other people have published. People can publish just like apps, they can publish. The, or you can create a card and just put it in your group so nobody else can see it. So you have both the flexibility, right? Now, going back, let me show you another thing which is the public group. The public group concept is how do I how do I connect with my all my customers? I don't know them all. I know them, but who's going to put them all? So what we have done is if you go out and look at the discover page, you see the discover icon in the bottom left. You go there, you connect, you go to the public group, and you can actually now become, let's say, public uh, republic world. He's already part of the group, so he can just open it from here. And you see how the public is using a public group. Almost 12,000 people are connected to this group. And they are basically sharing all the news every hour throughout the day, actually. And more importantly, not only do they share news, but they use this as a way to get sentiment of what this nation is thinking. They do these quick polls. Go back and show the polls. Like, can you take that? Yes. Maybe say yes and send it. And you can, you know, you have responded yes. Now, what these people have done is they have created custom cards. So, can you go to the cards here? Here, they have only three cards. So any citizen can write to Arnold, he is the star reporter of that, of that media company. They can give anonymous feedback, can you send a feedback to him? And I love it. And most importantly, because they require you to share your uh, location, we picked up Metro Manila and we are going to send it. Okay? 
And the last one was this public report. Okay. Uh, last card was a citizen reporter. If you are witnessing a event happening, you can video record it or write a little blog, blurt and send it to the media company and then they will do the news as a flash news. Okay? So that, those are some of the stuff. I'm going to now switch over to talk about manageability. Uh, can we go to the portal? So the portal and then let's see or show the, see the Excel integration please. In the portal, if you go to the, so this is the our BI I was talking about, if you go to the home page, you can see the different things you can do in the Kaizala Pro or Portal. Ah, click like that. You can create a group, you can you can do a bulk update of the users, organize reports and analytics, create a Kaizala card, action card and, and, and put it in a group, uh, build connectors, which is connected to the backend system, back and forth, both two-way communications. And let's just last but not the least just show Excel sheet. Excel group. You have to show removing because one of the one of the big asks of organization is I want to manage it. Not only just add people but remove people. So in fact, if you go to a group and show the removal, you want to show. Oh, why don't we do Excel sheet because uh, Excel integration. So here is the Excel sheet with a table. Now what we are going to do is uh, select the table and, and send table as a card because you want to get data back from, from your sales people let's say. And all I did was then I am going to go say share it with the contours of sales team that you saw, that group and yeah, So I am basically trying to get a daily sales report. And which happens today by taking pictures, sending it as a picture, data coming back, manually entering it. It is a very tedious process. Now, what? see what happens. That table became a simple survey. Simple field like survey like thing. And I'm going to go update those questions. At the end of the day, I'm going to say how many responses, quantity of products sold, uh, everything that I need to say for each of the product. And then I'm going to say update, submit. Now, all I have to go is, now, that's the employee, the salesperson, updated it. On the back end, the sales manager who sent that survey just refreshed and the data came here. <laughs> it's almost magical. It's almost magical, actually, right? So that's the, that's the kind of magic we want to bring to our, uh, to our users around the world. So here you now we'll go and show you how we can remove a customer from all the groups. So in this case, uh, uh, Ayush has uh, selected and I will say remove this person from all the groups. You have to remove yourself. Just remove in one place at least. <laughs> okay, you are removed from all the groups. That is as easy as that. So anyway, you want to show it in the phone? You remove. Is the other phone? Okay. Great, so that's, I will stop here for the demo. And uh, can you switch over?